you to me. How dare you point that thing at me? Stop with the emotions. You don't love me. You love what I represent. You love being the... Dude, do you even have a penis? Or are you one of those hermaphrodites born without genitals? Tricks up our sleeves, huh? <laughs> a few moments later. A bike ride along the Spucci Beach? Okay, Dad. I got just the thing to show you. This day was going so well until you showed up. You know that? Ugh! You know, you're lucky to even be allowed out of the house after that boat stunt. What's the big deal? If anything goes wrong, you can just fake your death and start all over. Like, how am I meant to develop my own moral sensibilities when yours are so unbelievably fuck-based? I'm going gray listening to this crap. Station change. Fuck yeah, I'm a jam. Don't push me. Seriously, some guys borrow your bow. Borrow? You were hiding in the head, crying kidnap. They just took receipt of your property with payment pending. If it was anything other than what you told me, then that's on you. All right, they fucking stole it. And who knows what they would have done if they found me, but I didn't expect or want them to get killed. You think I'm gonna let some guys ride off with my son? Look, I knew you were a bad guy, but- Oh, a bad guy. Shit, a crook, a killer, a thief, a liar. I guess I've been all those things one time or another, right? It's just... What? I always thought I was the good guy. God help the morally bankrupt planet your generation have left us. You're the good guy. Yeah. Anyway, I always knew you were the kind of person who didn't let other people get in the way, but I hadn't, like, seen that happen before. Yeah, well, that's me, Jim. And I've been trying my best to get things under control for the last 10 years. But that was an extreme fucking situation, and I had to act. A normal person wouldn't have done that. Here we are, the bike rental place. Please don't shoot the bike rental guy out of, like, force of habit. Hey, you! Two bikes. Take your pick. Hey, I really wish I could talk. I gotta go. I'll take this one. If I beat you to the end of the pier, you're buying me a new TV. Into the pier? All right. But if I beat you, you're gonna behave like a human being. Hey, Pop, if you're such a health nut, you should do a triathlon or some other midlife crisis nonsense. <sighs> I'm not gonna be able to stop this thing. Bond with your balls, hey, old man. Uh -oh. You're not button mashing oh, now, kid. Oh, I'm about to pass out. Oh, when I wake up, please let this nightmare be over. Jesus, hey, fucking asshole. Hold on. If I have a heart attack, what's your fault? Damn. Don't give up, even though you're losing. No, man. Jesus. Jesus. Oh, that shit ain't real. What the fuck? Ah. Oh, Holy shit. Holy oh, shit. Oh, shit. Oh, oh, shit. Oh, oh, shit. Oh, 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 Don't die. Don't give him the pleasure. Now, let me think. What am I gonna do with all that spare TV money? I'd never bike with the man who murked my flat screen. To the end, all the way. Oh, I'm about to pass out. When I wake up, please let this nightmare be over. The boardwalk ain't big enough for the both of us. I mean, like, literally, it isn't. We're both kind of big. You're a sore loser! Bond with your balls, old man! Try and take me then! <sighs> Whew. That 
that's it. Ah, number one, pal. You owe me a TV. Hey, I never agreed to that. <laughs> you know, this is real. Approximately 10 hours later. Dad, no, stop. Three days later. Shit! They're coming after us! Go into that outlet! If you say so, Trace. We'll be safe in there, Michael! Just injured. Run, okay? My dad's gone crazy. Stop chasing us and help Blake. You killed them. Oh my god, this isn't happening. Just calm down. I did what I had to do. Let me take you back to your brother. Okay, he smashed my TV and he took five minutes later. 